guys! Today I want to start this new video by giving a shout out to Sean Henry. This is a Care Bear shout out. So if you don't know what a Care Bear shout out is, is me showing you your favorite Care Bear while giving a shout out to your channel. And uh, some time ago, actually, I told people that if they actually told me what were their favorite Care Bear and if they uh, just commented what their favorite Care Bear is on my channel anywhere or on my Facebook or on my Instagram I would give them a Care Bear shoutout and it didn't work out like very very few people actually did that and so I just stopped bothering with it but Sean did it and he never got his Care Bear shoutout so this is Sean's favorite Care Bear this is Standard Hard Bear and he's want to say hello to Sean so Sean has a wonderful channel about toys, he does toys reviews, he does doll reviews, he does uh, blind box stuff, it's pretty nice. So I uh, can see that he's commenting on almost all my videos, his name is Sean Henry, so if you ever happen to see him, just go and look at his channel, it's pretty nice. Lot of different stuff. Anyway, so today I wanted to change the background and open the new Lil Fairy that I have. I have two Lil Fairies, a new, brand new Lipu and a brand new Erino. And I have the Erino from before. As a schoolgirl, very difficult to get coordinate doll. And something happened, guys. Something cool. This girl arrived. So this is the Yuzuha uh, regular version. And you can see she's dressed in sort of green, right? And this one is the um, uh, limited version that I went to get at the Asan store. And this one was delivered today. So I wanted to open this one yesterday. But because this one was not there yet, I kind of wanted to have two videos, one back to back, so that you could see both of them together. So I decided to wait. But since the bag, they, since they are kind of brown and green, and I have a forest background behind me, I decided, okay, I'm not gonna do the little fairy today, I'm going to open those girls. So, uh, who should we start with? I think we're going to start with the limited version because, hey, she came home first. So, first one for serve, right? So, this is the last doll coming out from the Mew Mew Alamod series. I'm going to say that at the same time, in August, you have a new version of Lise coming out. But this is basically the last character. So, me the Sarah Salamod has five characters so far. You have Saras, Maya, Alisa, Lise, and Yuzuha. And they already had, as you have seen on my channel, all eight dolls, so two by two, coming out from all four previous characters. And Yuzuha was the last character. And what is very particular with this Yuzuha is Yuzuha always has black hair. Or like I have one who has grey hair, but it's, she's still the dark haired girl of the group. And this year uh, they changed and they made Lise's dark hair doll. So instead we have this one who is dark brown and this one who is dark brown too. So we have two dark brown haired doll as user has. So let me open her for you. So, uh, this is Yuzuha, and I think she's very different from any of the others that came out recently. Like, she's very different from all the Mew Mew a la mode, because she has a sort of very classical and very out of time feeling to her, like my taste. She could even look sort of steampunkish, if you ask me, because of the color theme. So, let's have a look at her book. So you have the background, which is green and beige. And here you have the picture. So this is a regular, this is a limited. Then we have them with the 
picture with a little heart shape in the middle and everything they come with heels, shocker, cardigan, sleeveless shirt, dress, socks, wrist warmer, panties, uh, the tail with the magnet that goes with the shoes and the extra Miu Miu pair of hands. Yeah! And then here we have an explanation on how to put the magnet to in the panty to put the tail on. And then we have the extra clothes that you can buy at the Allen store to create different sort of character with those dolls. And they came out with that uh, non outfit this year. I don't know why uh, Japan has something with none because uh, once I was talking to the groove manager, so a different company, I was talking to the groove manager and he was asking me if he made a non pulley, would that be great? And I was like, why would you do a religious doll? Like in that case, why not have like every religious possible doll, like a Buddhist doll and a Muslim doll and a Hindu goddess doll or something, you know. But Azon actually came out with a non-outfit, which I think is very funny. And it's kind of cute at the same time. Anyway, and here you have the picture of both dolls. And you can probably already see why I say that they are very different than the other cats. So basically they are called Mike Neko, which means three colored doll, three colored cat. And because of that they have like some beige and some brown and some green on them. And that's a color that wasn't really used for the other doll in the series. I know Maya got green shoes, but that's basically it. So here, as usual, you have the little shocker, and she has a golden little bell. I don't think any of them has a golden bell. I need to check that out, and I'm gonna tell you that later, when I zoom on her. So that's pretty cool. So then we have the cardigan. I think this one is pretty cute because it covers like it's like hiding her heart style of cardigan. It's pretty nice. It can also work with like other clothes if she's wearing a pair of jeans or something that would work as well. No, there is no cat mark on it, so you can even use it if you don't want to be like catty style. Then the ears and I think the and the tail and I think they are pretty cool because it's also a very different because it's a three color cat so the ears have two color well three color like you have the beige and the orange brown and the gray here so Here you go, the ears. And she's the only cat with multiple color. So that's make her different. And yeah, like the other are all pink. Like every single one of them has at least one of the doll who has some pink on her. Like pink and blue, pink and purple, pink and brown, uh, pink and black, pink and orange pink and yellow I'm gonna I'm gonna manage and pink and white of course but she is the only one which is has no pink whatsoever so tail and magnet here and we have a little beige leg warmer in this bag not a leg warmer, wrist warmer, here. It's so fluffy, it's so fluffy. And then, because she's a limited doll and I got her from the Adam store, we have 
Yuzuha Panty. So if I open that, it's green, as you can see already. And at the back, you have Yuzuha, another cute little cat drawn here. And actually, they are selling like the ketchup on with panties or the Azon 50. And I kind of want them, but I only have one as on 50, so I have one chance out of four to get the right one. Which is not so great. But it's, they're all cute anyway. So this is the user happened. I still haven't found my Sarah's panty. There's, I, I hope I haven't lost it, but I haven't been able to find it. So, here are the hands. Nya Nya hand. And I'm going to put that on her directly. So let's open the door now. And see she has this design of a cat on the side and she kind of look like I don't know like a little girl from high school like early 20s? No, I don't know. Like the, the the anime that I think about when I look at that outfit is called in French Princesse Sarah and it kind of reminds me of that character because of the entire design of feel. Anyway, I don't know if you know what I'm talking about. So this is Yuzuha with a brown hair and green eyes, greenish eyes. Let me zoom on her and then I'm going to show her to you from close up. So guys, here is Yuzuha and there is a big, big, big problem. She doesn't have shoes. There was no shoes in the box. So I'm going to have to email Azone and tell them that they forgot to put shoes in my doll's box. And I hope they are going to send me shoes because, well, I don't want her to be like shoeless. That's bad. Like, it already happened once, they had the um, Lil Fairy released and they forgot to put the extra end in the box, so they asked people to mail them and they would send the box if you prove that you had bought a doll with them, so um, yeah. Basically, that's what's going to happen. I'm going to email them and see if they are going to give me uh, the shoes of the doll because it's gone. So. Anyway, so let's continue with the review anyway. I So here is my cute little Yuzuha and I, I like Azon doll with like the square cut. So this one is really going to go into favorite mode <laughs> for a while maybe. So she has this nice cut haircut and she has green hair to go with the green bow around her neck. And she has this uh, two color of hairs, like one gr one brown and the other grey. I'm sorry guys, I'm having trouble speaking. And uh, she has like beige on the side and at the middle. Then she comes with this little uh, golden bell and I checked out and actually Maya's also come with a golden bell. So we have like three doll with a grey bell, the silver bell, and we have the golden bell for Maya and Yuzuha. And then she comes with this... Uh, sh so she has a shirt underneath, and the color of that shirt has cat ears. Like, it's like the sailor type of color, and it has cat ears here. And it's sleeveless. Like, short, short, very, very short little sleeves. I don't even know if we can call that sleeves because it's just above the arm, above the elbow, but not at the bottom. So I don't think it's a sleeve, it's just a shirt like that. And she has this dress going on top, which is only with this attached here. And it has a lot of little designs, so the little fake buttons at the front. At the back, it's uh, you can open and close it with a velcro and it has this big, big bow which is pretty cool and then uh, it's like just kind of it I think it was cut as a full circle which is something new they don't have much full circle uh, dress 
with Aeson dolls so far. So it's pretty cool, it just like fly everywhere. And she has this cat design on one side with a little bow. So she's uh, the cat with the bow and then the cat with the bow again. And she has this uh, darker color at the bottom, all around. So basically if she sits, she can just sit and it's going to be like a circle around her. It's like if she dance and turn, it's going to fly, woo, fly high. So it's pretty cool. It's a very, very cool outfit. And she has this little wrist warmer. And see, I put the cat end already, so she can go mew, mew, mew. And then she has those adorable little socks with the bow at the back. So green bow again, and yeah. And of course, I cannot talk about the shoes because uh, there was no shoes in the box. So I'm going to check as one well say if they made a disclaimer or otherwise I'm going to send them an email. Anyway, so here is my cute little doll and I think she's adorable. I don't know what you think about that. But uh, I think changing the hair color of the Yuzuha was a good idea because I think that show like a little bit more diversity in the Yuzuha type of doll. And that's really cool. I haven't shown you the tail. Tail here. So I'm gonna put it up because I'm gonna take heart picture later. She's a happy cat. She has a up tail. And it, you see the color? It's like the three color again. So very, very consistent. But yeah, I'm so happy that they changed the hair color of the Yuzuha. She even look kind of like one of my Maya. I have a Maya with the same hair color. ta -da! They can be... No, I'm not gonna do and say they can be sister or whatever. But it's really cool. So guys, that's all for today's video. Uh, I will let you know later if Azon gave me the shoes or not and what happened with her and because I'm keeping her like I just want the shoes not a new doll or whatever so I'm just going to email them and let you know what's going on anyway uh, I checked out the box of the other one and she has shoes so normally that shouldn't be a problem with the other one but just for the limited version they forgot the shoes I don't know if it's just my doll or everyone's doll so if you have her limited uh, please check that she has shoes or not uh, before it's too late, I don't know. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give me a thumb up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. So, see you later. And have fun whenever you do. Bye!